boys keep Mom Marina bloats bustling. Life is full of things to do, including getting their childhood vaccinations. Well, we were a little late with the second one, you know, we're time consuming and working and everything. It's a nationwide trend and not a healthy one. The Journal of Pediatrics found the number of parents delaying or limiting their kids vaccinations is on the rise, tripling from 2006 to 2009. First one, you, you know, you keep track with everything. With the second one, it's a little tricky with a full time job. The CDC recommends more than two dozen shots given between birth and six years old. It protects children against 14 different diseases. Health experts believe believe it's minor in comparison to getting sick. The diseases are so dramatically disastrous for the children if they get the worst case scenario. Pediatrician Nancy Whittem encourages parents to stick with the program. The menu of the immunizations that we have are, are the ones that we've chosen is because we know that those diseases have particular problems. Some parents are shot limiters who don't like their child getting several shots in one visit or fear an adverse reaction from a group of shots. In fact, when vaccinations are authorized to be given together, they've been tested to ensure they're safe as a set. That piece of information should make it a little bit more comfortable to go through with the schedule versus feeling like, oh gosh, I need to space them to be kinder to my child. Ultimately, Marina pulled the trigger on her boy's shots. Because I think it protects them against worst illnesses. It goes back to something parents everywhere say every Every day, safety first. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.